I'm going to show you one way in which you can identify the ends of mineral insulated cables, in this case using my Mega MFT tester and a continuity test. I need to remove the resistance of both my leads and my link. I set my machine to ohms and I should find a reading of zero with those connected together. I connect to the outer sheath of my MI, which is my protective conductor, and one of the conductors at one end. I repeat the process using my test leads at the other end, outer sheath and one conductor, and you can see on the instrument there I've got a reading greater than it will read, so therefore no continuity. I move to the other conductor, I have continuity. I fold over the end on that one, plus the end on the other one so I can identify them the same. In this case, I'm gonna identify them with blue oversleeving as the neutral conductor, meaning the remaining conductor is my line conductor. I repeat the process on both ends in order that I can identify them, straighten out the one identified as neutral, and then follow it off with a piece of sleeving on the other one, and I've identified the ends of my mineral insulated cable.